Welcome back to Dishonored, part Cinque, part 5. Um, we had just dropped down and taken out a guard. We were looking for a whiskey bottle, but we couldn't find that, so we're just going to kind of ignore that for now. Um, and we're going to continue. We're looking for another guy, because there is another dude we were missing, so... I can't seem to find them, so I'm kind of concerned because usually I'm pretty bad when it comes to that. I don't want to kill anybody. So I don't know if standing in, like, light increases my visibility, or if that's just. Like, oh, you can see better now. Oh, oh. sweet. Fucking Jesus. I'm looking straight at him. Hmm. I'm just concerned about that guy back there. Alright. Well. That doesn't really give me any extra. Nope. He's looking straight at me. If I were that dude, I would have seen me long ago. The problem isn't this guy straight in front of me, it's the other one. I feel like such a Ooh! See, that's the problem. Alright, well... Ow! Oh, I can swim. Yeah. Can I go in here? Nope. Can I go over here? Nope, well... Oh! Wait, did I really just ditch them? Or now I backed myself into a corner. This isn't good. Where am I? What's going on? But I wanted all the stuff from there. They're just tossing rocks at the water! Retarded. I should just kill them all. I'm trying really hard not to kill anybody. Is this what they're supposed to do? Is their AI broken? Because like I feel like it should they should stop after a while. See that one? That guy's done. He's like no oh no. What the fuck? Fuck off, man! Whatever. Potion, carry on. Oh! Very steampunky. What's this? Oh, corpses? Hello. See, they're still on me! What's going on? Wait, can I... Can I, like, hide in here? No. I can just... Like kind of top in the trash. Hello. Oh, so I can pick up the bolts again. That's good. Uh, I wonder if I can use that as like a distraction or something. Like uh, shoot incendiary bullets at a wall. Bravo. Over here, quickly! I'm a friend. I'm Samuel. Samuel, you look like a mouse. I'm some good people. It's very much to meet you. Well, they said you'd come out here. I could still hardly believe it. I'll take you to meet them. Just down the river from here. Look around if you need. I need a moment. I'll be here. Whale! Don't take too long. So, is that whale labeled? What the? It's labeled. Why do they carry the whales? Like they don't. Okay, hold on. It, it's got a gun on it. It's that's the strangest looking boat I've ever seen, and it's got a whale on it. Ox. 
It's not an ox, it's a whale. You guys don't even know what you're carrying. Oh! Isn't it a big cone on the map? I actually thought that was like mossy rock, not just like endless pit of sorrow. Oh! Oh, those fishies are gonna eat me! Oh! Oh! Oh, oh! Oh, oh! Oh, please let me up! Oh! Oh, oh! Okay, um. Yeah, I'm, I'm ready to go, Sammy. Let's go. You've got a hot meal and a warm bed waiting for you. Fine by me, but that whale's really, uh. giving me the, uh, heebie jeebies. <sighs> Escape cold retreat. Hostiles killed! None! Didn't kill anyone. Ghost never detected. Okay, well, no special actions accomplished. Coins found. Okay. Okay. Okay, we're gonna continue. My perfectionist side is really saying, no, replay that mission and do it right this time. But usually when I do that in games, I get really bored after the first mission. <laughs> so, we're gonna just keep going. Hidden in an old bar in the river, your new allies have plans to share with you. Meet with the loyalists in inner circle to learn what they've gotten. Uh, at the Hound Pits pub. Press any key to continue. I hit spacebar. Sometimes I hit H. Oh, I can look around. This is the Hound Pits. Pub. Whale meat. So Most whales are. Business. Half the district marked off is dead from the plague. Right under the Lord Regent's nose, and he don't know a thing. So, well, is like an actual business, I guess. It's like a industry, and I guess we're of like. Course, if anyone finds out what we're up to, the watch will break in with swords drawn. And now that you've escaped, the Lord Regent's going to be tearing the city apart. So, I guess we're going to a very obvious spot, but since it's so it's obvious, it's not obvious. The, rest of the, the Admiral's a man to be reckoned with. Anyone can help you find that missing girl, Lady Emily, and clear your name. He can. Alright, well, we're gonna trust the Admiral. Thank you, Sammy. You're a good man for driving a boat. Strange looking boat, but don't welcome that. Hello. That wasn't a good sound. Mission clues updated. Press J to read. Samuel the Boatman has smuggled you across the river from Caldridge Prison. He works on an underground movement opposed to the illegal reign of the Lord Regent and has brought you to meet the members of the organization. Well, I wonder if there's any coin. <laughs> Whoa! This looks cool. It looks secret. It looks like I should go over here and ignore the storyline completely. Um, if I can get on that. Okay, maybe I was incorrect in that assumption. What was the point of that? Endless sorrow! Endless sorrow! Oh, Jesus! Okay. Spacebar? Spacebar? Okay. I'm just gonna stick with Samuel from now on. He knows what's up. Oh, but there's so much to explore. The outsider walks among us. I don't know what that means. I expect they're hard at work in there. Best join them. They'll help you get whoever really killed the Empress. Okay. Sick. Smoking's bad. Wait, we can talk? I'm sure the Admiral was anxious to meet you. It wasn't easy getting you here. Okay. I'm just gonna... Oh, I can just open this? Hello. Welcome to the Hound Pit Pub, sir. How may I help? Hello, sir. I am Wallace, and this is Cecilia. You're an asshole. We have been informed of your arrival and will do our best to stay out of your way while you conduct your business. Yes. Lydia's a servant here as well. Lydia's like a classic servant, isn't it? Dude, this place is huge. This is really strange. Because, like, I really want to, like, look around, but I feel... Like I should just... Go with the story. For the sake of, you know... Progressing and, uh... Entertainment value. What's over here? Okay, you know what? Mm-mm-mm. Well, I'll have time to check this out later. Curfew extends from sundown to sunrise unless you are otherwise authorized. Violent. Okay, so curfew is just nighttime. Oh, what? Starting the man. 
Even after six months in Cold Ridge Prison, he slipped out like it was nothing. Yes. Not surprised. We can just watch all the seven. <laughs> You've heard the story. Yes, I have. It still amazes me that someone could get to the Empress and young lady. No one knows the real story. We all have our suspicions. We'll know the truth. Gonna stroke my beard. He's strong and quick. But I hope he understands subtlety as well. This is one of the fancy dress parties. The reality is that we need men to kill. Have you ever killed a man? Only with my will. But it's a fair point, as always. He'll be here soon, and I'm looking forward to meeting him. Good way to end the conversation. Um, oh, oh, stick with the story. Okay. We can continue this later, Lord Pendleton. The man of the hour is here. Corvo, I'm Admiral Havelock, a true servant of the Empire, like you. Until the Lord Regent purged those of us who wouldn't recognize his claim on the throne. And I'm Lord Trevor Pendleton. I represent the nobility in our little group. But we all act as equals here at the Hound Pits pub. This is a, a very diplomatic view. I'm going to come out with it. We've been building a coalition of loyalists, aimed at ending the Lord Regent's tyranny and restoring the throne. At risk of Sounds execution, to we're mm -hmm. committed to finding young Lady Emily and seeing her crowned as Empress. We've got big plans, but we can't do any of it without you. We need your skills, your ability in a fight, and in helping us, we're going to help you destroy the men who murdered the Empress. Sorry, you must be exhausted. We can discuss this further after you've recovered. But before you retire, you should introduce yourself to Piero. He's challenging at times, but his industrious mind buys him that right. Alright, so I guess... Oh. Piero's as much an artist as a technician. He's going to be crafting the gear you'll need. Go talk to him, and then get some sleep. We can talk more when you've rested. Okay, so it seems like the point of the story is to uh, get Emily back. Good to have you with us. Um, which is actually, uh, I'm okay with that, because she really, really sucks at hide-and-seek. <laughs> so, it should be pretty easy. Uh, this was definitely was not open before, but alright. I'll be crafting your weapons and gear. All custom work. For you, I will create the tools of the Master Assassin. A master Assassin. <laughs> Tank of whale oil. Whale oil? What is Will this? Will you get a new tank from upstairs, please, while I hold this in place? Be careful. The oil's unstable. When it explodes, there's a terrible mess. What if I just throw it down the stairs? She's like, mm -hmm. have some whale oil here, you asshole. Oh. Connect empty tank to pump nozzle. Pull lever once. Wait for tank to fill. Move tank carefully. Oh. <laughs> uh, oh. Do we have like an endless supply or did I just waste that just because? Yeah, I probably shouldn't do that anymore. It seems like a bad thing to waste, although it was pretty hilarious. Oh, what's this? I don't care. Just Look at it. Near the receptacle. Magnetic. Perfect. Thank you. Cole. I like how they explain it with magnetism. That's good. The assassin's mask. You're a wanted man, so everyone in the city knows your face. But this mask will be a terror to you. If you just hold still, fit must be precise. There. Can you see normally? See the lens out of the line. Room. There. Better now? I could create more for you. Upgrades for your gear, weapons, munitions. I can't really see it. Our situation very well. here is desperate. Scavenge the city for valuables oh, and it we sell them on the black market. That should give us the money to craft the things you need. Tell me what I can make for you. Oh Jesus. Okay, let's have a look. Okay. Upgrades. Bullet oh, coins? Oh. Oh, spring razor. Oh. Rewire tool. Okay, grenade. An explosive grenade. Sleep bolt. Sleep bolts! 
Okay. Gonna look at upgrades really quick. Crossbow accuracy. Crossbow range. Okay. Mask optics. Bullet capacity. Bullet capacity. Grenade capacity and bone bone charms. The fuck is a bone charm? Um, okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna get the, um, I'll get the mass optics, so I can zoom in a little bit, um, and then I'm gonna just get a bunch of, uh, sleep bolts. Okay. Thank you, Kiro. You are quite a man. I advise that you get some sleep. Your life will get even more difficult soon. You should rest while you can. Sleep well. Oh, into bed. Thank you. That was kind of creepy, but thank you. <laughs> oh, I was expecting like a description. Press any key to continue. All right, we'll do that. In the next episode, in part six of Dishonored, I have a feeling, just a hunch, that this game is going to be much, much longer than Quantum Conundrum. So, uh, there should be a lot more parts, and that might be exciting or painful, depending on, you know, how you uh, receive these videos. But, thank you for watching, nonetheless, and if you would like to come back, part six. Alright.